Hey folks, welcome back to another episode of The Viking Bartender. I'm your host, John. In today's episode, we're going to make gingerbread popcorn or gingerbread popcorn coffee. That's right, we're going to be going back to the Nuggle Noggins kettle corn. Now you're wondering, wait, gingerbread popcorn, how does that taste? Well, it actually tastes really good if you mix it the right way, because you're not going to really get that strong popcorn kettle corn flavor at all because the gingerbread and the brown sugar and the vanilla is going to blend in very well so it's going to kind of overpower that catacorn flavor a little bit but you're going to be able to taste that catacorn flavor just enough but it's going to taste like and like a gingerbread popcorn and it's so good even if you mix it with coffee it's even better so of course i'm going to use the gingerbread vodka the nuggle noggins catacorn a little bit of the brown sugar cinnamon and of course the vanilla now like I said before you don't have to use the gingerbread vodka you can use the gingerbread syrup or the gingerbread cream liqueur now of course there's only one type of cut of corn which is of course the nuggle noggins whiskey so you're not going to find any other uh, cut of corn flavors out there just the nuggle noggin only and like I said, the brown sugar cinnamon, you don't have to use that brand in particular. You can use anything else, like the cinnamon type flavor, but you have to use a small amount of that cinnamon because the cinnamon itself is very strong. It overpowers a lot of the flavor. So like I said, just use a small amount if you want to use cinnamon. But if you use brown sugar cinnamon, if you use the right amount for that one, it's not going to be overpowering power as well. And of course, the vanilla syrup you don't have to use a vanilla syrup you can use a vanilla cream liqueur out there or a whiskey type vanilla flavor or a vodka flavor type out there but in this case we're just going to use these brands in particular and of course the coffee so i'm going to make two versions on the rocks and coffee so let's get straight down to it all right so i'm going to do on the rocks so it's going to be an ounce of the gingerbread vodka an ounce of the cut of corn. And of course, one fourth of the brown sugar. And half an ounce of the vanilla. And there you have the gingerbread popcorn on the rocks. All right, now I'm gonna make the same drink, but with coffee. So of course it's gonna be an ounce of the vanilla vodka, an ounce of the kettle corn, one fourth ounce of the brown sugar, half an ounce of the vanilla, And of course, two, three ounces of coffee. And there you have it, the gingerbread popcorn on the rocks and gingerbread popcorn coffee. I hope you enjoy. I know I'm going to. 